Good evening, I'm Terry McFadden. And I'm Lauren Moss. New details, the Career and Success Academy Charter Network is expanding in South Bend after announcing the opening of a new high school near the downtown Medical Mile. They're calling it the Portage School for Leaders and they're already accepting applications for the upcoming school year. 16 News Now reporter Jack Springgate joins us live outside the soon-to-be schoolhouse to tell us how their model is challenging the typical high school experience. Jack? Well, Lauren, you already said it. they're calling it a school for leaders because that's exactly what administrators say they want to get out of the students that go here. While those leadership skills obviously have their advantages post graduation, these students will be testing them out from day one, both inside and outside the classroom. The experiential learning part is going to be a major tenet of the experience here for students. That's part of the formula that sets the Career and Success Academy schools apart from many other schools in our area, both in curriculum and in the rankings. Both the Career Academy High School and Middle School earned an A rating from the Indiana Department of Education. No other public school at South Bend besides Adams High School earned that rating. The Success Academy Elementary School was given a B rating by the state. The Portage School for Leaders looks to build on that success while also letting their students decide where their learning journey will take them. And so that means we have to listen to what their interests are, what their passions are, and care about what they're interested in in their lives and bring that into the classroom and into the academic experience. Administrators say they're also committed to empowering their teachers in the same way. Teachers having autonomy to make decisions that are best for students I think is going to be really important. We want to hire the best teachers but I see you know really attracting local teachers uh, to be a part of again something new and innovative and different. Their approach doesn't measure success just based on test scores and quiz results because they understand that college will not be the next step for all their students. We're looking at measuring success not just the traditional academic ways but also those employability skills you know those long-lasting durable skills that they're going to need to be successful so we're going to be looking at all of those. Now, whether your student's path is towards continuing education, uh, whether it's a skill, trade, or even if it's a career, they can get on track at the Portage School for Leaders starting this fall. Now, enrollment is already open, and they're only accepting 150 applicants, and it is on a first-come, first-served basis. Find out how you can get ahead of the pack when applying by heading to the story on our website, WNDU.com. For now, reporting live in South Bend, I'm Jack Springate, 16 News Now. All right, Jack, thanks so much. Turning